Hi everybody, it's Jacob from uJuices.com. Uh, today it's a big day for all juicing freaks, as you can see. Uh, I got here the two machines, uh, which I don't need to introduce to you. You have been waiting for this comparison video for a long time. And today uh, we finally will be able to show you uh, the results. Uh, it's, uh, we haven't seen the results yet, so for us it's also a, a totally new information. So um, here we go. So uh, this is my little brother Tom. Uh, he will help me today with the carrots. Uh, we got a one kilo of carrots and we will start with this. So that was it for, uh, with carrots, and now let's take a look at the results. So let's measure the juice first. So uh, we got a weight, uh, or we got a, uh, let's say, 500, 550 milliliters of juice uh, on the left side, and we have a weight of 562, and on the right side we got a, let's say, that would be like seven, 700 millimeters, exactly, and the weight of 722. Okay, so now uh, we are interested uh, how much pulp is in each juice, so therefore we will strain it for you.
So let's measure the juice uh, once more without the bulb. So after training the juice, uh, we have uh, on the on the left side the same amount of juice, which is the 550, I would say, and the weight of uh, 560 grams. And on the right side, we have a still a little bit below the 700 milliliters, let's say 690 milliliters, and the weight of 705 grams. Okay, so now it's time to measure the bulb. So on the left side uh, there is a weight of 322 grams and on the right side we have a weight of uh, 233 grams. If we look at the, the pulp you can see it's fairly dry so we have made a really fair job with the juicing. The same, the same is on the right side. So the next step, uh, we will be juicing one kilo of oranges. Uh, with this machine, uh, we will not use the titration method. We will just use the pressing, as the as the manual says, and we will use the the cloth uh, instead of the bag. Okay, so let's take a look at the results. 
Okay, so let's take a look how much juice uh, we have. So on the left side we have a amount of, I would say, 550 milliliters and the weight of 561 grams. And on the right side we have a amount of 790 or 80 milliliters and the weight of 809 grams. As you can see, um, the the juice structure is a little bit different, so we would we would like to strain the juice again. Okay, so now uh, we would like to we would like to take a look at the, the pulp. As uh, the pulp seems to be uh, still wet enough, so we would like to give it a second try uh, and see how much more juice we can get. So as you can see, uh, after the second round we have been able to get a uh, little bit more juice, which I would say will be around 15 more milliliters. So now it's time to measure, measure the pulp. So on the left side we have a weight of 326 grams and on the right side we have a weight of 138 grams. Okay, so now uh, we have here uh, one kilo of apples each and uh, we would like to try to press uh, the juice with uh, two bags at, at a time.
Okay, so this was apples, and let's take a look at the results. Okay, so let's take a look at the numbers. So on the left side we have uh, the amount of let's see, almost 700 milliliters and the weight of 704 grams and on the right side we have a uh, juice yield of I would say 700, 750 milliliters and a weight of 807 grams. So now we will again strain the juice so we can see the, the structure of the juice. So as you can see, the juice from the right side got got a little pulp in there. It's a little bit more pulpier than on the left side. On the left side, we we have a clear juice. So on the left side we have a weight of 187 grams and on the right side we have a weight of 84 grams. So now we will juice uh, 680 uh, grams of leafy greens. So let's take a look at the juice yield. 
Okay, so uh, as you can see, we got a lot of juice here, so we will need to get get it all in in, in the juice jack. So I will do it through this. So on the left side we have a juice yield of let's say 480 milliliters and a weight of 476 grams and on the right side we have a juice yield of 580 milliliters and uh, a weight of 588 grams. Okay, uh, we would like to strain the juice again. And let's take a look at the bulb now. So on the left side we have a weight of 94 grams and on the right side we have a weight of uh, 56 grams. So that was it for today. Uh, the point of uh, today's comparison video was to show you the two most efficient machines on the market uh, head on head. Uh, which you have seen, you have seen the results. Uh, we hope you enjoyed the video and see you next time. And don't forget to visit our website www.eujustice.com. Thank you for watching.